All right, dynamic warm-ups. First thing we're going to do with dynamic warm-up is uh, get them moving up and down the court. So I'm going to have Drew do what we call a kangaroo warm-up. So Drew, face the camera. There you go. So all the pretty people can see you. So what he's going to do is he's going to do three big jumps. He's going to do them in slow-mo right now. Go ahead. One, two, and three. And when he's doing that, he's really tucking his knees up, kicking his legs back. And the third one, he's going to spread face that way. Yep, he's going to face that way, okay? And he'll have one foot in front of the other. He will go three steps forward, stop, and do the jump again. All right, so come on back here, Drew. We'll go this way. Okay, so do it slow-mo again. All right, hop, hop, hop. Now he's going to go one, two, three, hop, hop, hop. All right, stop, come back here. Nant will come over with you. So what you do, great warm up. I usually do this right at the beginning of practice. Do it for 35, 40 seconds. It gets the uh, uh, juices flowing a little bit, kind of stretches them out. Um, it's a good one to kind of get those muscles loose before you do any other dynamic stretches. All right, so let's go. Let's go down to half court on this and then come back. Ready, go. One, two, three. Yep, good. Pause on that legs thing. Good, go, good. Now to half court. Now turn around, come back, turn around, right there, come back. Good, go. Perfect. Why I like this drill too is it's teaching, you know, what do you do in a game of basketball? You do a lot of jumping, you have to be able to pivot and move quickly. Basketball is a, a game of up and down, very fast spurts. Uh, you know, I'll put something down in the bottom, but it's, I have a, a great uh, statistical thing that basically says, you know, if you can go fast for short periods of amount of time, that's important. I wouldn't do this full length of court. I do it one or two, three two times down, turn around, come back, maybe have them do it in two or three different groups and that would work great. 